So do you know that bananas share 50% of their genes with humans, or vice versa, you can say, and that is only 1% of your DNA. Hi everyone, this is Miss Yuki from Rebass, and today we're going to do extraction of DNA from a banana. So first step, take a Ziploc bag, and in the Ziploc bag, we are going to put half of the banana without the peel yeah so I put it in we have zip lock back zip it and use your hand to mash it okay really put your energy in it to mash the banana into pudding like texture okay remove all the big clumps like this into a mushy mushy texture like this the reason why we need to uh, mash up the bananas is actually to increase the surface area for the following reactions to happen okay for you to be able to extract more dna from the banana cells next we have a beaker of hot water here and some table salt put a little bit about a teaspoon of salt in the hot water mix it up so i'm using a pipette to do that so once the salt is dissolved, you have to pour your hot salt solution into your mashed bananas. So after you add the hot water, mix the mashed bananas with your hot water for about 45 seconds. Be careful not to mix too much that the bubbles form you want to have minimal bubble formation okay mix it up for a bit and next we will be using dish washing liquids so we are the reason why we're using this washing liquid is because the soap are able to break the cell membrane of the banana cells so as the cell membrane breaks you will be able to extract whatever that is coming out from the cell so here i'll be using about two drops of this washing liquid mix them up together again make sure that there is no large bubble formation and next we have to filter your banana mash so here i'm gonna use a sieve with a tissue and just pour them in and filter the mashed banana juice. So we're gonna put them into a test tube. We are gonna put it to rest for a minute. And the next crucial step would be using ice cold isopropyl alcohol, IPA. Okay, and this one will actually coagulate your DNA together. So you'll be able to see them using your naked eye. So be careful when you're pouring the alcohol. Tilt your test tube for about 45 degrees. Pour your alcohol in slowly because you want to have a two separate layer. So instantly you will see some mash substance forming and that is your DNA from the Bananas. This is a very simple experiment that you can do at home. And of course, when you're dealing with hot water, make sure that you have adult supervision. So do you know that bananas share 50% of their genes with humans, or vice versa, you can say, and that is only 1% of your DNA. So your DNA is basically a deoxyribonucleic acid that is basically a manual or an instruction of how a human being works. So if you want to know more about DNA, stay tuned.